guys. All right, team. It's 11 a.m. We're just pulling out of the slip here in Atlantic City at the Gold Nugget Marina. We're going to go fuel up, top off the ice tanks, and uh, we're out of here. The ultimate question is what we're going to do. The, the water is up north in the Hudson and the Toms. Uh, we got word that it was a little slow there, and one of my buddies just called me on his sap phone, uh, and he's down in the Wilmington, and um, he had about 10 to 12 fish, so we may call an audible and stay closer to home. So we'll see. I'm going to talk to the guys, put a plan together. All right, last minute preps. Fueling up, icing up. I think we're ready to go. Fuel Maddie up. Maddie thinks we're ready to roll. Fuel up. Fuel up. You can see in the distance, Gold Nugget Marina. It's absolutely beautiful out today. We're going fishing, baby. So this is this is the not fun part. Paying for the fuel bill. We're at Cameraman's Marina, right here in Atlantic City. And this is my biggest enemy right here, this thing. But I can't get out of my own way. I always tell them, don't even tell me what the bill is. All right, we are out of here. Fueled up, iced up. We're out of here. We're going to the Wilmington. It's only about 70 mile run to where the fish are. So a lot closer than what I was thinking of doing. So I'm pumped. So it's Sunday now. We're fishing into Monday, but look at the mob scene. That's why I don't fish weekends. Look at it. Got her. Go. Look at y'all. Not a clue, any one of them. I love it. We're going off the port side. Look how pretty that is. Beautiful. That's beautiful. This cut, dude, I just cut all their lines. I'm sorry. I had nowhere else to go. <laughs> Yo, I cut every one of their lines. Oh, I'm so sorry guys, I didn't mean to. This is the, you see while everybody fishes. I didn't have any room, so I cut lines, I didn't mean to. All right, let's get out of here. All right, hold on. We are out. Bye bye Atlantic City. Bye bye land. Thank Lord. Get me out of here. Yeah, thing. Got Freddy at it. Woo! All right, introducing Billy. Cruising. Matty. Billy, you your doing? first tuna trip, right, bud? First tuna trip. Um, so we'll get them. Dude, I sure hope so, man. We'll tie you into one. Of course, we got my co captain, Zachy. Hi. I just took a shower on the way out. I've been running around all morning. So I was sweating. And I feel like a million bucks. So He, he looks like a million bucks yeah. as well. He looks like a million bucks. <laughs> so we're chilling. We're having a good time. We got about uh, 41 to go. So we're getting there. All right. Good afternoon, everybody. It's 2.30. Just getting on scene here. I talked to one of my buddies. He's been picking fish all day. Talked to my other friend who was here at First Light. Did real well. He said he had... 15 bites within an hour, so it's beautiful out here, knock on wood. The guys are set to spread, working hard. Got our internationals rolling. So we're just getting on scene, seeing what's what out here. A lot of times it takes a little while just to kind of get the pulse for the trip. Uh, and then, uh, you know, we'll work these canyon walls and check back with them when we hook up. All right, team, it's about 3.30, 3.45. Billy's hooked up. It's his first tuna ever. Let's see if we can't get him in the boat. Reaper. One with the candy, baby. So you want to fight a tuna? So you want to fight a tuna? <laughs> Good 
job, bud. That's a beautiful fish. Good job, bud. That's a good one. That's a beautiful fish. Dude, look how pretty they are. Aren't they beautiful? Good stick. Good job. Yeah, baby. So guys, this was one of my favorite trips of the whole year. Uh, for some reason, right when we got set up in the afternoon, uh, Zach just really wanted to run the boat and uh, really kicked me out of the bridge and sent me down to the pit. So I ran the spread, I gaffed all the fish, leadered all the fish. Uh, it was so enjoyable. Uh, my first couple boats, I really did everything. I ran the boat, I worked all the lines. As the boats got bigger, I really kind of had to um, you know, be a little bit more up in the bridge at all times, you know, running the boat. Uh, so it was so much fun being down in the cockpit uh, once again. I, I absolutely loved it. And then again, it was probably my favorite trip of the year. Okay, we got Billy and Maddie doubled up here. Had a nice blow up, so we'll see. Both inside bars, they came up tight. They came up in tight. Yeah. Yeah, they both both came up tight, yes. Billy's fish made a nice run. Not right now, not yet, not yet. Come on, a couple more cranks. There you go, bud. There's a good one. Yeah, baby. Come on. Woo, Woo that's Woo. one. Face, Not bud. the best stick. They're so beautiful. It's a nice yeah, one. Come to this corner. Come to this corner. It wasn't the greatest stick. He made like a little wiggle right at the end there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen it. You know? That's all right. He's in the boat, baby. That's all the Beautiful matters. yellow fin tune. That's a little bear one. Yeah, bud. Good job, dude. Yeah, baby. Coffee maker, full sink. Not so sure we have enough rolls. <laughs> snacks, all the snacks you can possibly imagine. Full fridge number one. Gotta have the Royal Farm chicken. That's key. Beers for the boys. Tons and tons of Gatorade, stay hydrated. Couch for chilling. Little dinette. Gotta have the Viking hat for luck. In the morning, if you wanna get a quick little shower, you're into it. One bedroom. Too bad. So for overnighting, 
this is a nice boat got a lot of extra creature comforts so far so good i really enjoyed this boat guys this will get him going baby molly crew will get him going baby every time <laughs> molly crew baby get some fish going all right guys what's it about seven 7.30, looked up, Let's see what we got. Oh, man, I think he, are you sure? Yeah. Oh, he's a little tiny guy, look how cute. Stop it, really? Look how cute. Oh yeah, he's pretty small. Look how cute he is. Billy, grab that. Look how cute he is. I'll tell you what, he hit a lot harder than that. Yeah, I can't believe it. I mean, that's a keeper. It's a keeper. Yeah, yeah. he's pretty. It hit like it was twice that size. Yeah, I know. Yeah, he hit These, I'm telling you, the bars, they fool you. Yeah. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Yep, yep. So you got 29 inch fork length. He's sushi. Beautiful yellowfin yeah, tuna. Matty, hold him up, bud. Still drop him. Perfect, beautiful fish. That's such to see me right there, boys. Get him. I just pulled out my lucky shirt. I know, man. We got That's, all it was. That's it, baby. I didn't even put the lucky shirt on. We got that. Just made a cup of coffee. We need soup again. Yeah. That's all. Cap Zach is slaying it up there. Oh, we got color. What you got? Little guy. Yeah, another little dude. Come on, little dude. Look how pretty, guys. Look at that sun going down, guys. Absolutely beautiful. A bigger boat on an overnight is nice. Get some of the creature comforts at home. Stay warm, dry. All right, so at night we uh, released a small hammerhead and then we had this really decent sized Mako. Uh, it was really hard to see. It was really, really rough. So it was actually tough to get the sex on this fish. Pretty confident it was a female. You know, she was probably about 70 some odd inches. Um, and at that size of a fish, you really should see some pretty decent sized claspers, which we did not see. So we revived this girl, let her go home free. Uh, no harm, no foul. She did great. What's up team? 5.05 AM. We just released that Mako. Good end to the night. She was probably high 60 inches again a couple years ago. Perfect eating size fish, uh, but we had to let her go. That's okay. Uh, that's okay, you know, uh, yeah, that fish was hooked right in the jaw and she'll be just fine. So we're back on the troll and uh, we'll go from there. What's up team? 6.20 a.m. It was a slow morning till now. Dude, we're doubled. Yeah, we're doubled, baby. We just got nailed. It was a slow morning up until now. Uh, it was about our fifth bite in the last 10 minutes. So just like that, the bait started rising up in the water column. We got that fish on the plug. We got reset, bam, bam. So we got two on right now, so we'll see. So the first of that double was a short. We let him go real quick. Billy seems like a better fish, really tore off a lot of drag. What's neat though is I worked away from the fleet a little bit 
I'm um, in a little deeper water. Uh, there's a lot of bait here. So hopefully this one's a little bit better and we'll, we'll put them in the boat. downstairs to get a pair of shorts and uh, the bed looked awful enticing so I laid down and that was the end of me what time is it now Maddie it's, it's 11 wow I missed a lot how many more did you put in the boat Gaff two more Gaff two more all right so we got eight in a box probably a total of 12 or 13 fish oh of course we have a skippy in the box right skip jack tuna for shark bait on Friday so I'm awake now here we go. Let her rip. Hang ten. Hold that bad boy up. That's perfect size, baby. Nice. Good job. So this was pretty cool guys to end the trip i actually sat down i said you know what guys let's get one more fish if we get one more bite i'm gonna reel them in i very rarely reel in fish anymore i'm old i'm fat uh zach literally ran up to the bridge and said one more fish coming up 30 seconds later bam there we go so i fought this fish it was the biggest one of the whole trip of course i beat it up like no other we high-fived it came on home Doc, come on, land out our catch here. Ten yellow fin in the box was the take. We released about five. Seventy inch class Mako as well. A hammerhead. Action pack trip. Action pack trip. Touchdown. Action packed. Zero complaints. Too bad, huh, guys? Take. I remember catching this little cute guy right there. Yeah. Better class fish than last week for sure, man. Okay, so we're down south. Yeah. We're going to get lots of meat. All right, team. Here's another yellow fin. This one is stuffed. I can feel his stomach. Look how distended it is. So let's see what's inside. Check this out, guys. This is from the belly of one of these yellow fins I'm cutting up. That's a whole mackerel right there. Just a little bit digested. That's pretty neat. And then he's got a whole nother one right here too. A little bit more digested. The other ones were spitting up squid, but that's pretty neat. I felt it in there. <laughs> 